Hello everybody, welcome again to my YouTube channel. Today I want to talk to you about the situation in Jamaica, the crime situation especially. Let me tell you something. From I was a child growing up in Jonestown. I actually lived on Woodrow Street in Jonestown. To be exact, 28 Woodrow Street, Kingston 12. As a child, I saw a lot of people died. I saw a lot of young people, old people were losing their lives. And Jamaica since then, from the 1970s, it has been an ongoing situation where people have been just dying. It's at least a thousand a year in that small country of three million. Now, what I don't understand is in Jamaica, they claim that they don't have enough resources. For instance, if you call the police, they very seldom come. Yes, and I'm talking about personal experience. I've had that experience when that where my life was on a threat and I called the police. And they 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 they, they, they just circled the area. They never did a thorough work. But most of the time in Jamaica, when you call the police, sometimes they tell you they don't have enough resources like the car and so on. If you tell them to use cameras all over Jamaica, oh, we don't have enough resources. Now, we, the people are still dying, at least a thousand every year in that country, small country, yeah? We, this last year, have this so-called Pandemic. They have shut down the tourism sector, shut down the entire economy almost, grind to, it, it is almost coming to a grinding halt. Yeah? The country is losing money. I've seen Canada decide to stop sending um, plane there. Yeah, there, there, there's no flight to go to Jamaica and they're telling people not to go to the Caribbean where it's nice and sunny. I don't know, I understand why if you're on a pandemic, why you can't have people going where it's less, you're less likely to have, to contract this, this, this so-called virus. All right. So we don't have the money, they claim, to equip the police and the soldiers with the resources that they need to fight crime. How in the world you explain now you can be locking down the entire economy? Yeah? You're locking down the country. Curfew all kind of few. Because you claim to have an invisible thing that will kill you. The, 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 what was happening from 70 in the 70s come right up it, 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 when at least a thousand people are losing their lives. It's, those are not lives. Why you didn't lock down the country and do something about the crime? But you can lock down the country under this guise. My friends, people are not stupid. We are being played. We are being played whether people want to believe it or not. We are being played, yeah? Somebody has sold out the people. It's a sellout. Some big men come down in that country with money the other day. Big men with big money. And all of a sudden, everybody's just working with the program. Everybody's just working with this darn program. That is distress. It bring, has brought so much distress on people's uh, uh, finance. You didn't have the money to 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 fund the police and to and to and to get cameras all over and do the necessaries that is ne the things that are necessary to bring the crime down to um an acceptable level. 
But you can shut down your economy now under the guise of this thing. When it is people who are losing life the same way from the crime problem. And they claim that people are losing life now from this virus. Don't you see something is wrong? We are not stupid, Jamaica. We are not stupid world. People are, are understanding what is going on. I know the masses have buried their, their heads in the sand. But the vast man, a lot of people, I heard, even heard Vibes, Vibes Cartel say it the other day. We have just been sold out. And that is what is happening. I thank you very much. We've got to let the truth be known. And I know they don't like these stuff. But the truth has to be told. And thank God a lot of people know the truth. It's time you all stop, the, stop playing people. We are being played. Big time. Take care of yourself.